This was incredible. That's all I gotta say. This was incredible. Girl, I really need you in my life now. When you put it on me, girl, it's man down. I know ain't nothing like me, tell him pipe down. No, ain't nothing like me, tell him pipe down. Maybe you can swing my way. You know I don't play no game. Fighting good girl, I'm gonna grip on your way. You guys, so I am at this. What is this place called? Spa and Sea Luxury. Luxury Spa. Let me find out. This is like, this is why I love Africa because you just never know what you're going to be doing. I was actually asleep, just chilling. And my homegirl's like, you want to come and get your nails done or whatever? You just, you want to get your, your hair done or your toes done? I'm like, mm, I guess so. So I've never been here. Let's see what this is like. This is going to be so dope. I didn't even know this thing was like a thing. So let's see. It's Senegalese own, guys. Oh my god. Okay, nice. 
guys. This, I don't know why I'm kind of nervous. I, I don't know. I've gotten massage one time at an acupuncturist spot and uh, it was nice. So I don't know, but I'm excited to see what this is going to be like. I'm going to try to record it a little bit, give y'all a little bit of footage. So let's see how this goes. Okay, y'all, so I'm not gonna lie. If you know anything about the massage world and the stuff they be on, um, I was a little bit uh, suspicious, you know? I was like, I don't even know what I signed up for. I may have added something to this massage package that I am not aware of and that is not wanted. If you know, then you know. So, I was just like hella suspicious in the beginning. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. See, and here's one thing about Africa that you may or may not know. Things are so unexpected. Like there's a surprise every time you leave your house. So sometimes you, you ask for things, they say, yes, you're gonna get that and it's something else. And so I'm just like, okay, I know she said this was like a pressing massage. Like, is she gonna be pressing me the whole time? Like pressing? Like. <laughs> But at this point, she's brushing. I'm like, okay, skin brushing. I know about skin brushing. Nice. Uh, okay, pressing and brushing. Okay. And then she starts to do this particular movement. And it's like this, this blood circulatory Thing and I can feel it in, in the, in the, on the soles of my feet and, and she starts to massage my ankles and I'm like, okay, what is happening? 
So then she starts doing the same thing for my calf muscles. And y'all know I got like big calves. Like people are always like, what kind of calf muscles on a slim girl? I mean, I needed this. Like my whole calf muscle life, I have been missing out on like the calf muscle blood circulatory massage. Like I had no idea. I'm like, this is something different. She's, she's breaking barriers in my calf muscles. It was actually a little painful at first. Like I could feel that the fluids in my calves and my back legs that they needed to be, you know, like straightened out. And and I'm like, whoa, like she's doing it. Like we're we're going to another level. What is this? After she does my legs, then she moves up to my back and she is just getting every like area that needs to be got. I mean, she was massaging my fingertips, y'all. A tip massage. Oh, look, 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 look at this move right here. She's she's like doing origami with my limbs. This is like origami press massage, blood circulatory heaven. Like what? At this point, I'm asleep. I'm dead ass asleep. I'm gone. <laughs> okay. This is getting in my my neck, like my upper neck, like massaging the back of my ears. What are you doing to me, ma'am? And then of course, she flips me around like a rotisserie and massages the front of my body. I'm like, of course, of course, it wouldn't be a full body massage if you didn't do the front. This is amazing. I'm like in and out of sleep and I'm just like, what did I do to deserve this? Like, what? like how, <laughs> why? <laughs> oh my God. Y'all gotta come get this massage when you're in Dakar, seriously. So I decided to get my nails done next and it was really nice. The lady was gentle with me. She wasn't rough on my hands or anything. She allowed me to change the color a few times. It was a really nice experience. You see, aren't they cute? They were so cute, slick, shiny. I love the colors I chose. Yes, yes. Now I have to do my little extra thing. You know, you know how it is, ladies, when we get our nails done. It's like, oh, what? You say what? Huh? Who, me? <laughs> Okay, you guys, so I'm at the end of my surprise spa day. And oh my God, like today was amazing. Like talk about manifesting just a life of luxury and a life of ease. I definitely did that. Like my homegirl dead ass called me just out the blue and I just had no idea. She didn't even have any idea. She was just there. And was just like, hey, you want to come up here and get anything done? Like, anything. Like, it's on me. Like, come up here. I'm like, no, no, no. No, you know. You know, just no. She literally insisted. She wouldn't even let me say no. And, yo, I got a full body massage. Like, I needed that. Like, I'm about to sit here and meditate and just really sit with this. On a deeper level... On a level of what I always talk about, which is manifesting and attracting more of the things that you want, um, attracting a life of ease, taking the path of least resistance, and um, and 
um, being on a high vibration where, where, where treatment, where people are treating you well and people are gifting you and people are appreciating you and reciprocating like that kind of thing. There's a certain vibration where you begin to attract so much of that. And that's all that's been happening um, since I turned 33, especially since I really started doing um, consistently uh, the things that I teach, you know, what I do my sessions on and which is alpha meditation, which is really rewiring my brain and really focusing on the things that I want and not the things that I don't want, really being able to um, check myself and um, cancel any negative thoughts, replacing them with good thoughts. Um, yeah, talking to my inner dialogue, um, healing from my traumas and things that people have done to me, things that I've done to myself. Um, yeah, letting go of any guilt. Um, just, just all these levels and, and just really like, really like when we say putting me first, like making myself a priority, there's, there's another level that I really believe that, 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 what that means, what the definition of that is. And that is what I have been doing for the last um, seven months, almost seven months exactly. And it's another level to really program yourself um, to remember who you are, to remember that this really is a matrix, um, that, that we really live in a imagination world, a really holographic world, and we when we say people project, we're always projecting. Everything that we feel is what ends up being our world, what ends up going on. And that's projection. That's coming from you. It's coming from how you respond, what, what, what you actually see out of the situation. And so, oh my God, I hope this is making sense. If it's not, it's just not supposed to right now. It doesn't mean anything. Listen to it three more times. It'll make even more sense. It's just the way things go. <laughs> but there's just so much, ma there was just so much magic in today. So much, um, what do we call it? So much confirmation on just what I am attracting in the vibration that I'm on. This little lock in the back is annoying. Um, <laughs> but um, that's what today was about. And I was so appreciative. I'm not one of those people that will um, I mean, I'm, I'm one of those people that will not let you forget like what you did for me. So this kind of thing is just, oh my God, there's so many levels to this. And, um, I'm really, really grateful. I'm filled with gratitude. Oh, that's what I was going to say. And the massage. Okay. When I, oh my God, damn, that massage was crazy. I so needed that. I'm so grateful. Today was really, really cool. It was very interesting. And I ended the night with my favorite food that's here in Dakar, eating at Caliente. Um, and um, really, really good sisterhood. And, you know, we danced and, and really, really just fed each other, you know? And, um, and I love being around this sister because she's a dreamer like me. She's a number three. Shout out to all the number threes. If you are a number three in numerology, it means that you are a child. You're very child-centered. You are the your birth, right? One man, two woman, three child. You are about creativity and giving birth to things, making things happen. Uh, and you have you do a whole bunch of shit. You number threes never just do one thing never just do five things. <laughs> um, but she's a number three too, and she's a dancer. And so we just really had a good um, ending of this day. And I mean, this may or may not make sense to you guys, but it's so much deeper. Oh my God, life is just so deep. Because when you think something is happening just for you, it's happening for other people, and certain things that happen go for more than one thing. Like there's more than one lesson in it. And it's for more than one person. Like there's so many people in one equation. If that makes any sense. Anyway, you guys, this is my closing to this day. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. And if you like this video, thumbs up. I want you to know that
you are a soul having a human experience. Until next time, peace out. <laughs> oh yeah, look at my nose. Ah! Girl, shut up, girl. <laughs>